It's not just man-made pollution that threatens the creatures in the lagoon. Other human activities are also killing wildlife. We're here at an animal hospital called the Loggerhead Marine Life Center. Every year, they rescue hundreds of sick and injured sea turtles. One, two, three. This is Ron John. He's a hawksbill, and he had fishing line wrapped all around his flipper. Our way up. The flipper was paralyzed when he came in here, and the doctors are slowly nursing him back to health through massage. This is Ivanov. Ivanov is a juvenile green sea turtle that came to us back in December. Uh, he was suffering from an injury caused by a boat propeller. And unfortunately, that propeller strike was in a, a pretty bad area and it affected his spinal cord. So we're needing to clean this wound out regularly to keep the infection from spreading into his spinal fluid. Okay. Is there anything I can do to help? Sure, if you want to come around and you can, okay. uh, you can help hold him for me while I clean out his wound. All right. Is this a common injury you see here at the hospital? We do. We see several boat propeller injuries a year, uh, mostly to the, to the shell or the soft tissue. And um, some of the strikes that we see on the turtles are actually the, the length of this, this whole turtle. We also see a lot of fishing line entanglement, hook mm -hmm. ingestion. Uh, so a good percentage of what we see are human-related problems. Okay. Want to put him back? All right. He's ready. <laughs> Oh. 